Hey Sumolings, it's your boy Doc Williams and today we're going to be talking about Tile. Now this is a platform where you can create high quality video content for social media in just a few clicks. And in this video we're going to be talking about how you can get started with this product right now. And also we're going to be discussing how this compares to in video. So come with me. All right, everyone, as always, make sure that you like and subscribe to the AppSumo channel and make sure that you go to AppSumo.com slash tile to get this deal before it's gone. So let's dive right in. Now, after you buy this this item, we're going to be taken to tile.io and I'm just going to get to the main dashboard. When we come here to the main dashboard, it's it's pretty simple. It gives us a preview of a of a piece of content that we can use. But the magic, what I like about Tile is how simple this is. A lot of times I struggle with trying to create content or know what to do or how to switch layers. If you look at the corner on the left hand side, you click that button and it allows you to toggle through the title, content, lower uh, logo, box, and the video and images. It allows you to edit very quickly. And as you're editing, it allows you to optimize the field in which you're using. So if you're using it for a YouTube uh, piece of content, Instagram, Facebook, it is optimized based on the size. And I, I just like how simple it is when you're using this, uh, this platform. Also too, if I look at the preview, even before I click the preview uh, button, it shows me how long the video is so far. I really like this because if I'm using, you know, Instagram stories, if I'm doing something on Facebook, now I can start planning out my content accordingly. Also, if I look at the template uh, tab right here on the left hand side, if I click that, that allows me to change the theme, change the message and the size. Now, what does that mean? If I change the, the, uh, the, theme this allows me to look at the mood and i can start changing the mood based on what i'm trying to convey for my content this is really helpful if you struggle with design or you, you just don't have time you're managing a business and you need content that is high quality and you just don't have the expertise as a graphic designer or you have someone on your team that is going to be helping you with the marketing, but they need guidance. They need to have already the aesthetics in place. And they just need to have something plug and play. These templates are perfect for this. Also, I like the messaging. Very limited right now, but I, I like where they're going with this. This allows you to, to have templates already for explainer videos, promos, and then introducing a class very easily to get started. And right here, I can see to start now, it already loads up the template right here. And overall, it tells me the that this, this video is 21 seconds. And I can go through here and make changes, change the order just at a, as a few clicks right here, right? So I go here, now this is the first slide. Now, why is that so important? This allows me to be able to create a storyline very quickly. And now, if I need to change out the images, change out the colors, all those things, very easy to do. And then I can preview and do all of those things right here. Save it and export. I can do all of that in a few clicks. Also, I can change sizes based on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, all of these different things, Twitter. I have all of those things already meant for me so my team can create content at a quicker rate. Now, a lot of questions I've been getting recently is, what's the difference between um, Tile and InVideo? Now, let's talk about this for a moment, okay? This is not comparing, th they don't do the same thing. It's not for the same audience. I would think if you're a if you're a team that needs to put out content and have a very specific style and have a have it done in a concise way, I would go with Tile just because it's an easy plug and play and 
there's not a lot of options right now. It's, it is what it is, right? You're either going for explainers, uh, explainer videos. You're going for promos. It's very specific. And the way that you're designing it, if you have all of your assets, the hex code for your brand, your logo, it's a plug and play. You export it, you're good to go. For in video, you have more options, but I actually don't like the UI UX as much as Tile. Tile is very uh, straightforward, very clean, very easy to do. In video, there's a lot more options, but you know what I find? I, I find I get I get lost in in video. There's so many things that I could be doing. I I just I just don't I don't use it the way I'm supposed to. And there's so many different options like article to video, pre-made templates. I find that there's just so many things going on. I, I get lost in it. Tile, I've it, it's just a totally different experience. So this is what I, I, I want you to do. I want you to challenge you. If you've already bought in video, how are you using it, right? This isn't, a, this isn't something where I'd be like, okay, you have in video, you definitely need tile. I'm not saying that. I, I want you to really think about how are you using in video right now? What are you lacking? What are you missing from in video? Or is it you're not using it to the full right now? Or are you getting confused and something's happening? Now let's go with tile. If you already have a team that just needs structure, it needs to put out a number of pieces of content, you already have all of your branding and you just need to have more content, I would use Tile. So again, before, I don't want it to say like, this is a versus video. It's just different, there's different case studies. People are gonna be using these platforms in different ways. But what, I, what I've found is a lot of times when people are asking, well, I, I want in video to do more or there's something, I'm, I'm, I'm struggling with finding a lot of people using in video to the full and that's different than if you're finding it confusing or a lot of things are missing. Like, I'll, I'll show you a perfect example, right? So I'm going to pick uh, just an intro. An intro, let's get started. Okay. Have this, let's use this. Let's use this template. Okay. Okay, it's loading. Let's go through this. Okay, so we're ready to go. Right here, as I'm going through everything, I have the uh, timeline down here, and this is pretty standard. If you're using any kind of software such as, you know, Filmora, iMovie, anything, you're, you're probably used to uh, this kind of timeline, and you're gonna be able to see the animation, what's happening, all of these things, and you're gonna be able to edit and add scenes, etc. That's okay. That that's fine if you like this. But what I found is I like Tile's version of having it based upon slides and then going through that timeline better personally. So again, I like this for my style of workflow and this just makes more sense for me. But again, I, I want you to really think about how are you using in video? Have you used it before? What are you using it for? And then are you getting stuck? And if you need something more concise, perhaps Tile's the right platform for you. So I hate to give, you know, generics or, you know, this isn't, this isn't a all tell all or like which one you should do. It really depends on how you want to use it for your business. But I urge you to think about what are you doing in your business right now? Are you doing it? Are you trying to have a VA do it? Are you trying to teach your team? because either platform is not going to basically make all the content that you're looking for without having a plan behind it. And it depends on your workflow, your team and your intentions, depends on what platform you're gonna go with. So let me know in the comments below how you're planning to use Tile and uh, other questions that you might have for the product. And uh, I will answer every single one of your questions. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video.